Trump's address to Congress was watched all across the country and right here in South Florida, of course. Students at one local school listened as the pontiff delivered his message. CBS 4's Ted Stanton is live right now in West Miami-Dade with what they had to say. Hi, Ted. Hi, Ruta Bay. Well, students here at Belen Jesuit are keeping a very close eye on this. This is a Jesuit school, a Jesuit pope, the first one to address the U.S. Congress, so obviously there's quite a sense of pride here. A packed house at Belen Jesuit watched as the Pope addressed the U.S. Congress. Just the fact that he's there impressed students. It was very clear that there were some issues. You, you saw Biden clapping for some. You saw um, Boehner clapping for others. But at the same time, he was, he was not trying to be political. As the Pope continued speaking, students appreciated that, popular or not, the Pope brought up issues that many would not. I was really surprised that he brought up the death penalty. In, indirectly, he brought up abortion. and. Uh, and brought, just brought up the vicious cycle of pro poverty. Pope Francis has always been a trendsetter, and he's starting, you know, changing the way that, that popes do things, changing the way that we look at things. And Catholic school students have been watching the Pope since he arrived in the United States. They'll be watching especially close again tomorrow when the Pope addresses the United Nations in New York. Live in West Miami Day, Ted Scouton, CBS 4 News.